We've been dropping names all night. I we so, have. I'm so glad this guy came by to see us. I, I love his show. How many of you watch American Pickers? Isn't that a great show? Well, here's a co-host of that show, Mike Wolf. Mike, come on out. Good to see you. Yeah, nice to see you. An official resident of Mike Leaker's Fork now. What in the world are you doing here, man? You're, you're like on my TV in my living room, and now you're right here at Music City Roots. You know, Frank and I took a, long, a wrong turn in <laughs> Cooksville, and we ended up here, and I'm glad that we did. He's in the van right now. He's crashed out in the back. And uh, I came to get some biscuits, and I walked around the back, and I saw the venue and walked in. It's incredible. It's my first time here tonight. It's amazing. Oh, wow. Great. Pretty great venue. And you are, you are a music fan. Uh, and, and what kind of stuff do you listen to? Um, that's, that's something that uh, him and I always argue about when, he's in the, when we're in the band. He's always into, like, big hair music, you know, Metallica, White Snake, and I'm always listening to... Ernest Tubbs, Lefty Frizzell, yes. little Charlie yes. Feathers, yeah. um, you know, obviously Hank Whalen. Uh, well, Charlie Feathers had some great hair. Oh my God, Charlie Feathers, Feathers was amazing. In fact, I had a, a line on the show where I said, uh, me got what me want when me got you, and uh, Bubba Feathers called me, and that was an honor. Bubba is his son, and it was really cool to talk to him. Man. You've been working lately with, uh, with Brian O'Hearn, who produced some of the most significant albums in modern country music, uh, all the great Emmy Lou Harris albums of the 70s, Brian produced, and that you guys are like pals, right? Yeah, he called me about a project called Music to Pick By. I have a link on my page, on my antique archaeology page called Music to Pick By. It's just music I like. And he's like, well, how would you like to do a, a, a CD with traditional road songs? And I said, that's incredible. And so we got together on it. And um, the kicker was uh, they, A&E Television wanted four original songs. So uh, Bron uh, Dale and I, Dale Watson, wrote four songs together. And it was, this is an amazing moment. Because as a picker, I find myself being a storyteller. And I think that's what music is all about, especially traditional roots music. And um, you know, being in Nashville and being here on this stage right now, this is a place where we all bend in our minds. You know, we all share that same journey, that same uh, memory, that same dream of the music the way it should be and the way it is now. So when you, come, when you walk down Broadway or when you're here, it's like you've been here before. So it just felt right when he called. We're so glad you're here. Let's give him a big Nashville welcome. Welcome to town. Great. Micah, what, what can we get for this podium here, you think, huh? Yeah. It's priceless. Oh, yeah. The podium is. Let's get Frank in here. It's priceless.